Hello everyone. Today we're gonna learn how we can move a file from one location to another location using UiPath. For that, I have two folders called data folder and information folder. I want to move personal information and records file from data folder to information folder. Now let's go to UiPath and see how we can do it. So in UiPath, I already created two variables called file full path and destination folder path. File full path variable will contain the path of input file which I want to move from one location to another location and destination folder path variable will contain the path of destination folder where I want my input file to move. Now let's take a multiple assign activity to assign values to my these two variables. So file full path and destination folder path. For file full path, let me take the value from the file properties. Copy as path and I can directly paste it over here like this. And for destination folder path, I'll go to my destination folder where I want to paste my file or finally move my file and I can paste it inside a double quote this is my variable assignment now I can go to my activity panel and take another activity called move file and I can cop drag this move file from here and assign values in from I will assign the variable which file I want to move and in destination, I'll assign my destination variable. Now I can run the process. You can see over here, personal info file moved from data folder to information folder. Now I want to move another file called records file. So I'll take the path same, go over here, then copy as path. Now in my file full path, I can paste it. So the, it will paste the full path. I'll press OK and I'll try to run it now. So it is throwing a runtime execution error. It is saying that file cannot or file cannot move when the file already exists. That means in my destination folder, which is information folder, you can see the records file is already there. But I want my bot to override this file. That means it should override this new file or you can say the input file to this older file where my speed is not mentioned over here so now I'll go over here and check this overwrite so it will overwrite the file in destination folder if the full file is already there it will overwrite now I can run it now while running it my run is done I can see there is no error and in my information folder, I can see my records file. Let me check whether it has got updated or not. Yes, you can see it has speed. That means it's a new file. Thank you for joining the session. I'll see you in the next session. Thank you. See you soon. Bye-bye.